At Centennial United Methodist Church, our mission is to create active, thinking, authentic followers of Jesus. And one way to do that is by caring for the earth. Hi, I'm Chip Small, also known as Henry Logan and Simon's dad. And I have a cool job. I teach biology and environmental science here at the University of St. Thomas. And I also get to do cool research projects related to sustainability. I want to tell you about one of these projects that we're doing in our campus garden. Here's what our garden looks like. This is a project uh, that's been going on four years now and it involves compost. I have been fascinated by compost since I was a kid. I used to have a backyard compost pile and we would dig through it looking for worms and mushrooms and see what happens when you put stuff in there. Some of you may have compost piles at home. Uh, some of you may have um, curbside collection of your organic waste so your food scraps get picked up and go somewhere else to get composted. Um, and it takes about six months or so for the microbes and bugs and other things to turn that uh, food waste and other organic material into new soil and the nutrients from that old food literally get recycled um, into new food if you're using that compost in a garden like we are here. So this experiment that we have, um, we're adding different types of compost and different amounts of compost each year and we measure um, how much uh, crops we grow and we measure um, how much nutrients are in the soil and we also measure how much of these nutrients are escaping when it rains. Um, we're trying to figure out how to do this in the best possible way because more and more people are living in cities and producing a lot of waste and also we have to figure out how to grow more food in a way that doesn't cause harm to the environment. There's a lot of great resources at your public library or online if you want to learn more about composting or try your own garden. Um, so check it out.